the lord be with you and, and with, with your, your spirit. spirit a reading from the holy gospel according to mark glory, glory to, to you, you o lord. lord chapter 1 verses 14 to 20 after john had been arrested jesus came to galilee proclaiming the gospel of god this is the time of fulfillment the kingdom of god is at hand repent and believe in the gospel as he passed by the sea of galilee he saw simon and his brother andrew catching their nets into the sea they were fishermen jesus said to them come after me and i will make you fishers of men then they left their nets and followed him he walked along a little further and saw james the son of sabadi and his brother john they to were in a boat mending their nets then he called them so they left their father sabadi in the boat along with their hired men and followed him the gospel of the lord praise, praise to you lord, lord jesus, jesus christ. christ the kingdom of god is at hand repent and believe in the gospel dear brothers and sisters in jesus christ as you all know that jesus has started his ministry from this a word of god the kingdom of god is at hand repent and believe in the gospel when we go through the life of peter and judas we can see repentance but differently gospel according to matthew chapter 26 verse 75 speaks about the repentance of peter when peter remembered the saying of jesus before the co cross you will deny me three times he went out and wept bitterly a drastic change happened an example of poor repentance is judas the same gospel chapter 27 verses 4 and 5 judas said i have sinned in betraying innocent blood and throwing down the pieces of silver in the temple he departed and he went hanged himself this was a guilt feeling our repentance should not lead us to guilt feeling instead it should be lead us to new hopes and directions in our day to day life judas did not turn to god to forgiveness and that is why he was a he went wrong the book of sirach chapter 5 verse 7 say that do not delay to turn back to god and do not postpone it from day to day let us begin true repentance of our sinful lives by turning to the lord admitting our sins and confessing to the sacrament of reconciliation let us examine our hearts and actions each day and turn to god for guidance may god bless